Now that your air conditioning unit is installed, let's install your CoolBot Pro. Make sure that you have all the items supplied with your new CoolBot Pro, as well as a screwdriver, pencil, and a couple of twist ties or zip ties. Please carefully read the CoolBot Pro Quick Start Guide that comes with your new device or download the manual here. Before you mount your CoolBot Pro and jumper in your cooler, you will need to place them in an area with good Wi-Fi reception. Plug both of the temperature sensors and the heater cable into the corresponding ports. Do not connect to your air conditioner and do not plug in the power supply yet. Now connect the CoolBot jumper to the CoolBot Pro using the provided silver-gray data cable. This cable is specific to the CoolBot Pro and CoolBot jumper. A standard phone cable will not work and may damage them. Now plug in the CoolBot Pro's power supply and wait until you see one flashing program light and the code E0 alternating with the current room temperature. On your mobile device or PC, enter this address to launch the web-based CoolBot app. On the first screen, fill in your email address and create a password. Select Create New Account. You will then be connected to our Plan Portal, where you can choose a subscription of your preference. A subscription is required to activate your account and to enable the CoolBot Pro's interactive app-based features. After setting up your subscription, the app will guide you through configuring your CoolBot Pro to talk to the CoolBot server through your wireless network. Follow the on-screen prompts to modify the Wi-Fi settings on your device to connect to the network called CoolBot. On most smartphones, go to Settings and Wi-Fi. On PCs, use the Network or Wi-Fi status icon. Select or enter the Wi-Fi network you want the CoolBot to use. This is usually the same network your phone uses, but it can be a different network if you prefer. Enter the Wi-Fi password for the network and press Next. Once the CoolBot Pro is connected to the network, you should see no codes and no flashing lights on the CoolBot Pro display. If your mobile device or your PC did not automatically switch back to your usual Wi-Fi settings, you may have to go back to the Wi-Fi settings on your device and manually do so. You should now see the current room temperature in the app. Your account setup is complete. You may unplug your CoolBot Pro from the power supply, and let's connect your CoolBot Pro to your air conditioning unit. If you ever need to adjust the data cable or CoolBot jumper placement, unplug the CoolBot Pro's power supply before plugging or unplugging the data cable. Mount the CoolBot Pro alongside of your AC unit. Do not mount it underneath to reduce the risk of condensation dripping on your CoolBot Pro. Unplug your air conditioner. Remove the front cover and discard the air filter. Locate the AC's temperature sensor and uninstall it. Remove the plastic clip. Lay the red tip of the heater cable and the AC's temperature sensor alongside each other and use the provided aluminum foil to wrap them together or use your own 2 inch by 2 inch aluminum foil. Make sure this does not hang in front of the AC. Remember, that most AC brands that are not LG or Hair have more than one sensor. For more information about secondary sensors, please visit our support page here. If you found a secondary sensor on your AC, place that sensor on top of the aluminum foil, not within, and hold it in place with a small piece of electrical tape. Do not over-insulate the foil while doing this. About one inch from the bottom of the air conditioner, between the bottom and second cooling pipes, insert a pencil about a quarter inch into the fins. Gently slide the fins temperature sensor, the blue cable with the black tip, between the fins in place of the pencil. Gently squeeze the fins around the sensor tip to hold it in place. 
allow the room sensor to hang freely in the cooler without touching anything. If you choose to use your AC with the front cover, route the fin sensor and heater cables to avoid pinching them. The CoolBot jumper should be mounted outside of your cooler in an area with good Wi-Fi reception. Drill a hole through the cooler wall and route the gray data cable between the CoolBot Pro and CoolBot jumper. The CoolBot jumper is not weatherproof. Install it in a weatherproof non-metallic enclosure if exposed to the elements. After your CoolBot jumper is mounted, connect the CoolBot Pro and the CoolBot jumper using only the provided data cable. Plug the power supply cable into the power jack on the CoolBot Pro. Plug the CoolBot Pro's power supply into the electrical outlet. Set the temperature on the CoolBot Pro by pressing the check mark button once. The current set temperature will blink. Use the right or left arrow to set the temperature to the desired value. Press the check mark once to save the setting. Plug your air conditioner in and turn it on. Set the AC to its lowest possible temperature. Make sure it is set to cool mode and the fan is set to high. Congratulations, you're all set up. Now you can monitor and control your CoolBot Pro from your device anywhere you have internet access. Learn how to change settings on your CoolBot, add the CoolBot app to your home screen, troubleshoot, and more by downloading the full manual here.